we are filmmakers and we are storytellers and we are that because first we are audience. We watch films, we like watching other people's work, we actually enjoy that process. So that is why we became filmmakers. So um, yeah, we enjoy the process. You know, when you watch a good film, it makes you envious and it gives you energy to work more on yourself. So it's, it's a great... And to watch the films in, on big screen is, is different, uh, like Roma when we watched last year. And then again I watched it on Netflix. The experience was completely different. You can't approach something as like, I'm going to do something different. Or I'm going to uh, do something that hasn't been done before. I think that's a sure recipe for disaster, if that's your intent. I think what you have to do is take a story that has moved you in some way. And what it made you feel, put that out there and transmit that in the most honest way possible. Uh, so sometimes those stories are not things that are part of the mainstream. Or have been part of the mainstream narrative. Um, and I think today with more screens, with more platforms, with a changing palette because of the access that we have, I think the audience is open to that. I think the audience is open to self-reflection and it's open to honesty. So a combination of all that I think has helped uh, uh, newer stories to come out. It's a really interesting time in our cinema now where you have within the span of three months a Ranveer Singh can do a Simba and then he can do a Gully Boy. I, I don't think we've ever seen a time like that in our cinema where an actor gets those sort of opportunities. Our audience is getting the sort of opportunities to be able to watch such a diverse palette of cinema. And I think what festivals do is they give us an opportunity to be able to watch films that we probably would not have had the chance to watch otherwise and to just expand our horizons. I mean, for an audience, it's just a chance to watch great movies. For filmmakers, it's a, it's a chance to watch the best of cinema from around the world and maybe learn new ideas or just enjoy, you know, movies that they would not have otherwise seen. But I think it's a really interesting time in Indian cinema today where it's not about limiting or moving away from what we were earlier. It's about expanding the palette of the audience where they can enjoy, like I said, a Simba and a Gully Boy with the same star and they both go on to do exceptional business. I think any story, whether it's big budget, small budget, with stars, without stars, needs a strong idea or a strong story. Right. Uh, today, it's not just about stars. You don't need a camera. You can make a film on a phone. It, I mean, the whole game's changed. Lunchbox ke naam se to hum log jane jate hain yahan pe Newton aur uh, Court. Court kitni uh, appreciate hui hai bahar bhi. So I think जब तक हम अपनी stories नहीं कहना शुरू करेंगे, तब तक हम international में नहीं पहुंच सकते हैं। अगर हम चाहेंगे कि हम international फिल्मों से competition करें, तो हमें अपनी कहानियां कहनी जरूरी हैं। जैसे court हमारी अपनी कहानी थी कि how does a court work in India? And I think we should make a film about how does a censor board work in India? Yeah, yeah. That will be a you know will make a mark.